Hi, I'm Philip Skraska, Visual Collections Archivist for the Bernard Becker Medical Library. You can play tennis here at the Richard Hudlin Memorial Tennis Course, just across from Barnes Jewish Hospital. The courts are in a corner of Forest Park that's had a long history of being a popular place to play sports. When the Washington University School of Medicine relocated here in 1915, along with the St. Louis Children's Hospital, this corner of Forest Park featured baseball fields. Some of our most distinguished faculty would find time to play ball. Everett Graham, the head of the Department of Surgery, who helped prove that cigarette smoking caused cancer, is shown here pitching a game between faculty and residents. These fields weren't the only place to play sports at the medical center. The Washington University School of Nursing had a tennis court near the St. Louis Children's Hospital. It was a favorite place to play for the nurses and staff, like the chief of pediatrics, Alexis Hartman. Dr. Hartman was part of the team here at the medical center that was the first to make insulin in the United States to treat children for juvenile diabetes. By the 1960s, the southeast corner of Forest Park lost its playing fields, and the new Kings Highway interchange cut it off from the rest of Forest Park. In the 1970s, Barnes Hospital made an agreement with the city of St. Louis to lease the land to build an underground parking garage. But as part of the lease agreement, the hospital promised to keep the space above as a park-like setting, and so built these tennis courts. In October of 1976, the courts were dedicated to Richard Hudlin, a teacher here in St. Louis and a nationally recognized tennis coach who trained two of the greatest tennis players ever, Althea Gibson and Arthur Ashe. So the next time you're playing tennis here at the Hudlin Courts, or just watching the US Open being played at the Arthur Ashe Stadium in New York, you can think of how this corner of the Medical Center remembers an important part of St. Louis sports history.